Gigafactories are at the heart of Tesla's electric vehicle and renewable energy revolution. Tesla has already set up Gigafactories in Nevada, New York, Shanghai, Berlin, and Texas. While the Nevada, New York, and Shanghai factories are already operational, the Berlin and Texas Gigafactories will be up and running in the next few months. In today's video, we will be focusing on perhaps the most unique of these five Gigafactories, Gigafactory 2, located in Buffalo, New York. While the other four Gigafactories are dedicated to producing electric vehicles and battery cells for those vehicles, Gigafactory 2, or Giga New York, focuses on renewable energy products, producing solar panels, solar roofs, the Powerwall home battery, and the Powerpack battery system for commercial and utility-scale sites. Originally a steel factory, the 88-acre parcel located along the Buffalo River was transformed over time to produce solar panels and solar cells. Tesla indirectly leased the site in Buffalo, New York, to build the Gigafactory through its subsidiary, Solar City, which it acquired in 2016. The site, which is owned by Empire State Development Corporation, was previously owned by Republic Steel and Hannah Coke. Following Tesla's acquisition of Solar City, Tesla built its factory on the remediated lands. As part of Governor Cuomo's Buffalo Billion Initiative, New York taxpayers contributed $750 million to build and equip Gigafactory 2. The construction of Gigafactory 2 started back in 2014, and it was completed in 2017. Tesla's subsidiary, Solar City, started the production of photovoltaic modules in partnership with Panasonic during the same year. However, Panasonic recently removed its operations from the Gigafactory 2 after developing differences with Tesla over their partnership. According to recent reports, Tesla intends to utilize the space that became available after Panasonic's departure and to hire as many Panasonic employees as possible at Giga New York. As part of its acquisition of Solar City, Tesla was committed to spending $5 billion in the area over the next 10 years and providing 1,460 jobs at Gigafactory 2 by April 2020. Tesla delivered on its commitment in early 2020 when it had more than 1,500 employees working at the facility. If Tesla had failed to meet that commitment, it would have had to pay a $41.2 million penalty to the state of New York. However, World events in early 2020 led to Tesla laying off hundreds of employees, which it has promised to hire back once production started again. Tesla had already hired most of its staff back in the latter half of 2020, with Tesla hopeful that the demand for solar roofs and battery storage equipment will increase in the coming years. Tesla is expected to once again have more than 1,500 employees at Giga New York in the coming months. Like other Gigafactories, Giga New York looks nothing like a usual factory, at least from the outside. The incredible production facility has a similar design as the other Gigafactories where Tesla has ensured to utilize all the available space through a huge rectangular design. Despite being extremely simple, the building of Gigafactory 2 is aesthetically quite appealing. From the inside, it is a highly efficient production facility where robots and humans collaborate seamlessly to deliver state-of-the-art energy production and energy storage products. While the 1.2 million square foot Giga New York does not match the incredible scale of Tesla's other Gigafactories, it does serve its intended purpose quite well. Elon Musk has stated his vision to accelerate the usage of clean energy and clean energy transportation throughout the world. Giga Nevada, Giga Shanghai, and the upcoming Giga Berlin and Giga Texas will produce the electric vehicles that will gradually replace the gasoline vehicles around the world. On the other hand, Giga New York is helping Elon's vision come true through the production of solar energy products, solar roofs, power wall and power pack battery systems. In 2019, Tesla added new production lines to Giga New York 
to support electrical components for supercharger and energy storage products. With all the focus on Tesla's vehicles, Tesla's solar roofs and energy storage products don't get as much attention as they should. The solar roof tiles made at the Gigafactory 2 are a revolutionary solution for generating clean energy without compromising on the aesthetics of a building. According to Tesla, these roof tiles are three times stronger than standard tiles, and they were specifically designed to be sleek and design conscious. As the solar roofs become more affordable and energy conscious among homeowners in the coming years, Tesla will be looking forward to increasing the number of employees at Gigafactory 2, and it may even be expanding the facility in case the demands for solar roofs see a similar rise to that of Tesla vehicles. Even if the demand does not rise significantly, in line with its commitment with the state of New York, Tesla will create 5,000 clean energy jobs in the state over 10 years. A vast majority of these jobs will be at Giga New York, which has already made the city of Buffalo a hub for substantial innovation and advanced manufacturing. What do you think about Tesla's Gigafactory 2? Do you consider its products a viable replacement for the traditional roofs and energy storage? Let us know by leaving a comment below. Also, like the video to show your support. Lastly, make sure to subscribe to the channel and to press the bell icon as well so that you can watch our future videos as they get released. We'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching Trailblazers HQ.